This is the walk that we're doing today. Amalia Gorge. Apparently it's better just after wet season because the water hole at the end stops flowing in the dry. But we're just gonna go for a walk anyway. Apparently there's a pool that's permanent halfway up so you can cool off in that as well. So we might even stop there on the way back to have a swim if the one at the end's no good. Hey, travel. We were back at El Cuestro for a few days and were stoked to be hiking into another gorge that we hadn't been before, Amalia Gorge. We've slowly been working our way through all the hikes and swimming holes and full drive tracks. Some of them aren't open yet. They need a grader to come in after wet season and fix up all the tracks, but I think they've already started doing that. So hopefully they'll open up soon, won't be too far off. Shadows down there in the water. I'm half a lot of sleep here. <laughs> This bit at the start and the end is probably the worst bit of the track because it's really rocky and so it's just the whole way you're sort of watching your feet where you're putting them so that you don't trip or roll an ankle or something. parked the ute up at Pigeonhole Lookout and sat up on the roof racks to watch the sunset and then we finished our day off back at the bar with pizza and a few drinks and there was a guy there doing a bit of whip cracking, fire whip cracking so that was a bit of fun. Oh, 
going on, mate? She slammed his door, you jumped this morning. Yeah. Now that we have the caravan, I don't really see us going back to like full time swagging it. Swagging it. Um, it's just too convenient in the caravan, apart from like a couple of nights here and there, or when we do the gib, we'll have to be in the swag. But I do really love sleeping under the stars. Be on the ground again, eh? Yeah, sleeping under the stars is pretty good. And like, you go to sleep under the moon, and then you wake up to the sun. It's pretty good. Not, not the same as the caravan though. <laughs> just the convenience and the comfort. Mm. It's pretty good. Jacko's just made himself coffee. Cheers. <laughs> Essentials. Life essentials. What a stellar morning. Hey. The little fellas are on the bite. Hopefully get some big dogs here directly. That guy went so hard. Yeah. Hey? <laughs> Sorry? I brought it with me. <laughs> yeah, mate, yeah. Dinner and a couple of wines. Emmy is down. She's slowly been sinking lower and lower. <laughs> Shaka bra! <laughs> Shaka's bra! <laughs> Back in Kananara, we had a plumber come and fix our leaking hot water system so we can get everything put back away under the bed that's been outside. Luckily it wasn't anything serious, just some seals that needed replacing. And we got a fancy new tap put in the kitchen so Val's had a nice little spruce up. Then we went and watched the local Kununurra Rodeo. Yeah. Yeah. 
feeling hungover and I didn't even drink. I don't know what happened. I don't know if it was just the late night. I don't know what it was, but I woke up feeling hungover. Jack, how are you feeling? Pretty good. Yeah, Been a bit tired, hard. but tired. looking forward to a swim with live me up. It's good fun. It was a fun night. It's Catch up fun. with a few old mates. Mm, that's good. Let's go. Yeah, it's freezing. 